Wildlife Control is now on the lookout for a 13 foot long runaway python in Oklahoma City. We first brought you the story last week from the Burntwood neighborhood. Fox 25's David Chazanoff spoke with the man hired to end this pursuit once and for all. So David, how does he plan to catch this giant snake? Yeah, Adam and Wendy, Trevor Bounds tells me he plans to install a couple of cameras underneath the home that he believes the snake is hiding in. It's a situation that folks here at Bryant Elementary School, not too far away from the park, are keeping a close eye on. Honestly, <laughs> it makes me feel uneasy. From the trailer park to Bryant Elementary, this 13 foot long python is the talk of the area. It's kind of terrifying because it's been there for like four months or whatever. More public schools even sent parents this message, encouraging them to talk with their kids about how dangerous this animal is and how to stay safe. It's kind of scary, especially like you don't you don't want to think about it, like getting into your house. But what if it did get into your house? It's a really big snake. Trevor Bounds with Redbeard Wildlife Solutions says he's determined to catch the reptile. I think it's because of the size. You know, everybody's in panic mode. But he's confident he'll get the job done with technology. And once we get once we get the cameras installed and get everything, the cameras will kind of tell the tale. Bounds plans to surround a home in the trailer park with at least two thermal cameras. We're going to have a view on this one um, and then this area over here, that hole and then back here. If I was that person, I would be moving. <laughs> Luckily for that homeowner, Bounds has already created a trap. And once he installs the cameras, he'll be able to watch everything 24 seven from his phone. It, it, it sucks, you know, the whole 24 seven thing, but it's easier to just, if there's a chance I can get the job done, I'd rather take that. It's a problem he wants to tackle fast as the snake continues to eat stray cats around the park. Dangerous for them, for sure. But I mean, as far as, you know, people, they want nothing to do with people, so, you know, they're going to stay away from them. Still, Bound says if you see the snake, don't try capturing it. You know, it'd be a horrible idea to approach, you know, especially trying to handle it. You know. And Bound says normally he's able to capture snakes within three to five days, but he tells me worst case scenario, this could all be over within two weeks. Reporting live in Oklahoma City, David Chazanoff, Fox 25 News.